the event's been great. Uh, we're here seeing a lot of uh, interest and action as far as what we've all been kind of hoping was going to happen, which was really the uh, activation of a lot of these personalized experiences across both linear and digital. Um, and it's exciting for Adobe, given the, uh, the number of tools that we have, that really can help our media and entertainment customers better understand not just their inventory, but their customers, and really help to drive uh, a high quality customer experience. Um, so often we get kind of enamored with the technology and, and the services behind a lot of this, but at the end of the day, we really have to deliver a, a robust experience for the consumer to really help drive an engaging, uh, ex uh, an engaging uh, experience for them. So we're excited about uh, what, what all that entails and, and the opportunities forward on that. Depending on the, the solution set, we're, we really look at it across the, the media and entertainment vertical in, in general. Um, there's a number of different areas that I think uh, Adobe's uh, in a strong position to really help for. Uh, one is actually just the, the overall data infrastructure and helping to remove uh, the silos between the different data stores that customers have between their CRM data, uh, their consumption data, uh, their linear information. Uh, so we're doing a lot on, on that side. Um, we're also looking at re reducing the friction around uh, authentication. So a lot's happening with making sure that uh, consumers are able to discover and access the content that they want. Um, and not have to go through a lot of different hoops to better understand or remember their passwords or other things. So uh, we're, we're really excited about the opportunities on that side as well.